A trip to woodland. Retold by Jane and Sarah Brearley. Illustrations by Tony Wolf. The Captive. Just as he was testing his new fire-breathing abilities, Annette fell over Dragonist. I got you, fam! So, growled Firebrand, the blacksmith gnome. What have we here? Back in Dragonland, Dragobel was frantic. She went to the Dragon King for help. Please save Dragonix, she pleaded. Um, um, save Dragonix? Privately, he was thinking that at last there would be peace and quiet in Dragonland. Um, I mean, dreadful, dreadful to think of him being tied up. I'll see to it right away. But the Dragon King knew in his heart of hearts that the gnomes would be thoroughly fed up with Dragonix within a week. He sighed. I'd better tell Dragobel that. In the meantime, Firebrand was enjoying having a handy furnace for his work. Blow on this! There's a good dragon. What a useful little fellow you are. My mother will get you! Thrilled Dragon stamping his feet like the spoiled little dragon he was. Ha ha ha! laughed Firebrand. She's too far away to help you now, little dragon. All this time, however, Dragable had been hiding in the back of Firebrand's cave, trying to figure out how to save Dragonix. Meanwhile, the Dragon King was paying a visit to Crocus, the magician gnome. Crocus was very stern. You'll get that little dragon back only when we're sure your people won't set fire to our village again. You're holding one of our citizens illegally snorted the king. We'll declare war on you if you're not careful.